good day. Our task for today is drawing approximate lips. So, in your paper, you are going to project or draw vertical and horizontal line. And on the center of this or the intersection of these two lines, you are going to label it as point O. On the left side of your horizontal line, you're going to measure 7 centimeters. And that will be your point A. And on the right side, another 7 centimeters. And this will be your point B. On the upper portion of your paper, be sure 5 centimeters. This will be your point C. And on the lower portion is your point D. The same 5 centimeters. So this is now your preliminary. So the first thing that you're going to do is to connect points A and C using straight line. Okay, so inclined line connecting points A and C. So, using your compass, position it on point O and your pencil point on C, A, sorry, A, then strike an arc along the vertical axis so that you can locate your point E. Then, from point C, location of the compass, then pencil or point C, location of your needle point of the compass, then point E as the pencil, strike an arc along line AC so that you can locate your point F. So, from point F, locate or position your needle of the compass, then pencil of the compass point A, strike an arc, then position your needle of the compass point A, and your pencil point F, you have to strike an arc. And this will be your poem G and H. So if you're going to connect your la, uh, points J and H using a straight line, so the intersection of this inclined line line GH along the horizontal line AO this will be your poem key then your poem key or by the way you have to extend your line GH along the vertical axis so that you can locate your poem G jar then your line or point key you have to measure your point key using your compass so that you can transfer this measurement on the other side to locate your point L and your point G be sure using your compass to locate your point M. Okay. So, once you have located these points, you have to 
connect this using a straight line ML GL M key. Okay. So these lines are now the limitation of your major arc and your minor arc. So when we say major arc, this is the arc, the big here arc, while the minor arc is the smaller. So to connect or to construct your approximate ellipse, you have to position your compass, the needle of the compass on point K, while your pencil on point A, strike an arc. So be sure that the limitation of your arc will be on line M key and line G key. So, you have to transfer your needle of the compass point L so that you can construct the minor arc on the other side. So, be sure that you have your pencil point on point B. And now, we have our minor arcs. Then, the position of your compass point G to point C. So you have to connect this using your compass. Limitation is line key a G key and line GL. So you have to transfer your compass on line uh, point M. Then connect your major arc so that you can have or you can now finalize your approximate ellipse. Once you are done, use a darker line to represent your ellipse. So, this is now our ellipse. So, I hope that you have, you get the procedure. In a way, you can refer to your notes how to construct the ellipse. Good day.